Back in this country, uh, black farmers in this country are watching the calendar this week very closely and nervously. A proposed settlement to end a landmark discrimination lawsuit against the Agriculture Department could actually slip through their fingers. Why? Well, here's what we know. The settlement to pay $1.25 $1 billion to black farmers was agreed upon by the Obama administration last month. But March 31st is the deadline for Congress to appropriate the funding. Well, just last Friday, Congress left on a two-week break for Easter. Joining us now from Richmond with more on this, John Boyd, the president of the National Black Farmers Association. Good to see you. Hi, Frederica. Thank you for having me. Okay, so what next? If Congress did not appropriate the funding before taking the break and there's this deadline at the end of this week or really midweek, what's the expectation yes. that will happen? Well, basically, uh, you know, be calling on the uh, President of the United States and uh, I support the President hand over fist to National Black Farmers Association, strongly supports the President. But, Frederica, we're going to need him and his support and his leadership. Uh, to help us finish the job and work with leaders of Congress to get this done. But I mean, hasn't right the president now, already said that he supports this settlement because, you know, he, he approved it, so to speak, last month. But if it's up to Congress to, to get the check signed and, and dole them out and that didn't happen, what, yes. what are you thinking about the deadline? Might it be extended? I'm, I'm are you getting any indication on that? I'm, I'm thinking we're going to be able to work that process through. But what happened here is that the administration failed to mark this as an emergency uh, in Congress, which caused delays, and uh, also the administration failed to find the offsets uh, to pay for this. Mm -hmm. And uh, that's why uh, while Congress is on break. Uh, I've been trying to, uh, attempting to get a meeting with the president, because I would like to sit down and see what the administration can do to take further steps to ensure that Congress uh, acts. Uh, I've met with all leaders in, in, in uh, the House and Senate. Uh, the Congressional Black Caucus is working on this. But they also need help from the administration to find out where this money is going to come from and, or either uh, mark this as an emergency designation so we won't need offsets. So yeah. these are some things that are very doable, but we need uh, all everybody working together. And I'm going to work strongly with the administration and with leaders of Congress until we're able to get this done. Well, give me an idea, John, how desperately needed some of these settlement monies are for black farmers in this country? Well, you know, if we don't get this settlement, uh, farmers are going to miss another planting season. Right now, it's planting, it's planting time, and we thought we would have the funds secured to do this. Uh, every day that uh, farmers don't plant, uh, they won't have the maximum harvest. Uh, thousands of black farmers have died over the past decade uh, waiting for this restitution to come through. So this has been a very, very long fight, and uh, just last month, uh, thousands of black farmers were elated and excited that uh, mm -hmm. uh, uh, the government finally settled this case, now to find out that it's stalled again in Congress. And, uh, you know, Congress needs to work together, you know, both chambers of the House, uh, Republican and Democrat, and start working for the people again. And I think that's a major problem, too. So, John Boyd. Uh, uh, Thanks yes. so much. We talked to you last month about that excitement that you and many others uh, had about uh, this settlement and, and glad that you were able to come back with us to give us an update Thank and we'll check back with you to see if perhaps uh, you, you get an extension on that deadline or if you get any assistance yes. uh, in the next coming weeks. John, thanks Thank so much. Thank you very much and I want the farmers to know that I never give up, up this fight until it's uh, over with. I think they know it. Thanks so much. Thank you. All right, on the road again.